to the side. <clears throat> Now, I did go in today and pre-order my, um, pre-order my, not Crown Zenith, my Scarlet and Violet, and I got ETB for both guys, as well as two boosters. So we will be doing those, sweet little Deoxys, like that. I did play Deoxys and Mew. I kind of stopped. And Elisa Sparkle. We'll take that because we do play that deck. We'll take the Cook. We'll take a Cook Ball, even though it's going out of rotation. Glossophies. Shellment. We do love a Shellment. On to the next fusion pack. We're almost halfway there. Mala. Might be something. Ooh, Greninja V. That's pretty awesome. That's pretty awesome. I love a good V Pokemon. I'm gonna be kind of sad when they go. And we got <clears throat> EXs left, you know? I don't know. We'll see. I quite enjoyed this. I mean, I didn't come back until the end of the Vs, you know? So maybe it wasn't as exciting being in three years of this rotation but I, I like it I like it yeah this is oh Galarian Obstagoon good old hollow I love the hollows I'm a sucker for a good hollow Grim Snarl that's like barely holographic what's that about Snarl down there. Heat more. <laughs> wow. Yeah, heat more is not actually too terrible. I'm gonna snag that guy. Just put him over there. So yeah, so I got my Scarlet and Violet pre-ordered. Um, so that will be really cool, and then I also am probably going to pre-order a, actually this guy right here, more Peko V Union, because I think that might be interesting, so we'll check that out. Um, get a couple more Crown Zenith um, packs to open, because we won't be able to open a booster with it, and I'm only so far getting the ETB, which will only have 12 packs in it. So, Xelagor, and Arcario, well that's alright, because I will switch that Arcario out for my <clears throat> one in my new deck. That's not shiny. Alright, on to the Brilliant Stars from the Fusion. The Fusion was pretty lackluster. I mean, I did pull that guy, but I don't know what was like that. Blast. Ooh. You know, I always get tricked. I always think, maybe. Maybe since they put the V-Star in. Actually, I might. <laughs> Whimsket. Whimsket. Cool. You know, Psychic is my favorite uh, Pokemon. I love Psychic Pokemon. Um, <clears throat> so I always like, you know, pulling a good Psychic. Brilliant Star. Let's see, maybe I'll pull an Arceus from this one. That'd be pretty cool. That'd be pretty epic. Let's see, let's see what happens, shall we? Water. Oh, it's something. <laughs> Pikachu V. Wonderful. Premonition. Ultra Ball. Dusko. Alright, we're down to <clears throat> six packs. 
last of our brilliant stars. But yeah, so I'm down to get a couple more things from Crown Zenith. Um, I've seen some of the cards and they look beautiful. So, you know, go lurk. Nothing too great there. Ooh. Dedadine? Dedadine? Something like that? That's pretty cool. It's one of the cooler uh, alt arts that I've seen. Hey, a collapsed stadium. I like that. Alright. Time for some Astral Radiance. I'd love to pull a Dialga. I love Dialga. But, you know, I'd take a copy of two, I guess. Not off to a great start, though. The white one. Two, three. Flip that bad boy. Oh, throw the card. Miss Megus. And the Hissuing Avalok. Nothing great. Trek and choose. Hey, we'll take that. Critias. Alright. Get rid of those other ones. Let me just double check. Yeah. Those can go bye bye. <clears throat> uh, in the comment, you should let me know what your favorite uh what your favorite release so far in Sword and Shield has been. Um, I mean I wasn't here for really any of the releases. Um, actually, I don't need that. I have plenty of those. Um, but I think my favorite collection by far is this bad boy. I drop the back. Lost Origin. I think it was pretty awesome. Um, I came back right after Silver Tempest dropped, so it's kind of, you know getting back chasing those cards but something about Jaratina man oop this is something <laughs> the Syrian Samurott the star you like to see it you like to see it the other card I really like from that set is the Typhlosion I'm actually kind of sad I didn't ever get a Typhlosion from any of them but <clears throat> cause I also opened a booster box of Astral Radiance so that will be uploaded, and if you haven't seen it yet, you should go check it out. Alright, the last two. Let's see if Lost Origin fails me. Do you fail me? Yep, it did. It did, because that was a white booster, or white code pack. <laughs> old Polly freaking toad. And a chandelier. I have three of these. <laughs> All dark chandeliers. <laughs> That's hilarious. Chorus, you love to see it. I love Chorus. He's so good. Alright, last one. Here we go. I bet it's a white border. Yep. <laughs> that happens. Go fable. Violet Plume. Hey, I actually haven't had this card. I just ordered it, so it actually kind of works because now I can throw it in the deck. Steam Fisk, Survivor, good old Seedra. Okay. Well, guys, that is my opening of the Charizard UPC for Sword and Shield. Um, you know, decent haul. So. Those guys excluded, I got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. I got five V Pokemon and seven cards overall, plus the Galarian Zapdos, you know, holographic. Can't complain. So, if you like the video, please like it, uh, share it, subscribe. You know what to do, and we will catch you in the next one.